of all, it doesn't seem like a funeral in here. Last night I walked in, everybody was like on pins and needles because of the streak. So it's a little bit nicer tonight. Um, you know, there's not much I can say besides John Kravitz. He was outstanding tonight. Uh, picked us up when we needed a big win. Uh, in command the whole game. Uh, his first uh, complete game as a as a college pitcher. And he's been very, very good for us in the past. And so for him to go out tonight and uh, be in command the entire evening, uh, even when a run or two got on base, uh, just his composure, uh, it was outstanding. You know, Jason did a great job behind the plate uh, calling the game as well. Those two were in sync all night. And then uh, also Jason coming up with a big two strike hit uh, for the two runs. A little bit of a role reversal from last night. Uh, Maryland was able to you know, take advantage of a couple mistakes that we made and scored two runs, and we were able to do it tonight. And we just beat a very good team. I have great respect for Jake Boss and Michigan State, uh, how they play. Uh, they, they are definitely deserving of a regional bid. And so, you know, that, that's a great preparation for what we're going to be facing in regional play. Questions for the student athletes? John, what did, uh, what did Drew say to you when he came out after the air? He just said, calm down, they're doing great. Just make your pitches. We're going to get out of this. Something like something to that effect. You it's, don't know. <laughs> you something remember. to that effect. Whatever he said, it works. That's yeah, it was. Yeah, just kind of, you know, take a deep breath. You're doing great. It's going to be all right. <laughs> but yeah, it was, you know, put my trust in Drew. <laughs> I felt good in the pen. My my fast my past few times out, I hadn't been very sharp, so wanted to make sure I was locked in. You know, from first throw in the bullpen, and felt pretty good in the bullpen. Thought I was thought I had a chance to, to pitch a pretty decent game, and you know, I thought you know early on it was you know potential to be a pretty good one. Uh, Jason, what did you see that John had working so well? Uh, everything. <laughs> uh, it, it was the best I've ever seen John pitch. Um, truthfully, I mean, I've caught him now for three years, and. Uh, Caught a lot of good games from him, but uh, you know, kind of surprising after you know his last two or three starts where he was he actually really struggled, and uh, it was just awesome to see him come out and even in the bullpen, everything was on, and, and in the game everything was on. So that it was it was great to see. Jason, you guys didn't get really get in trouble until the very very end. How much of this game did you call, and how did you, uh, knowing what these Michigan State hitters could do if John made a mistake, how did you keep the ball away? Uh, he he only made mistakes in like maybe one inning, and it ended up with a fly two flyouts basically to the warning track, one in right, one in center. Uh, he he didn't make very many mistakes, uh, and and when you don't do that, and, and you have aggressive hitters like the Michigan State team, we were able to uh, pretty much play with them all game. John, as a senior, coach mentioned like there's a feel here last night, but I know for you guys it hasn't been about the streaks. It's been about going each day, doing your job, and coming out. It's worked out for 20 straight seven wins. Was it for you guys another day? I mean, you guys really, obviously you don't care about the streak, but just knowing you guys, it really seemed like you did care about it. Yeah, we were we weren't too worried about it. We want to, but still, we still wanted to, uh, you know, put a good show. We want to win this tournament still, and it's, uh, you know, we have a bigger picture in mind, kind of. But still, we're still trying to take it one game at a time. Even on the bus and stuff before the game, everyone's confidence was up. Everyone was loose. It was kind of just back to, you know, the same old norm. But uh, yeah, the streak wasn't. We weren't too worried about. It. I feel like we come to the park with the same attitude every day. Yeah, it's huge. And that was, you know, like I said before, is one of the one of my goals was to be locked in. I knew I knew I had had a had a, had to be sharp today and have a good start. And yeah, it's huge. I mean, I feel I feel great going into the next week, obviously. And it's been a uh, hopefully we carry this over. John, the strategy that you employed just pounding the zone and um, sort of pitching into contact, pitching into your defense, uh, it obviously worked for you tonight, but it carries with it the risk that. Yeah, I knew they're an aggressive team. I pitched against them earlier in the year, and I've actually they've had a pretty similar lineup the past few years. So I've had I've faced those guys, you know, three or four times, and you know, it's kind of the same thing every time with them. They're really aggressive and want to make good pitches with your first pitch. Don't want to throw you know first pitch right down the middle fastball and uh, you know pitch backwards a little bit. And fastballs off the plate and kind of let them get themselves out. And I, it's not going to work out always, but uh, the ball bounced my way today and. That was kind of my mindset, though. You know, make good pitches early on, let them get themselves out. We have time for one last question for the student athletes. Jason, coming up uh, with your with your hit, could you take me through that at bat? And did 
did you think that when you got the hit that two nothing was all you were going to need? Uh, yeah, I, you know, the kid had some uh, control problems pretty early, all, all basically the whole time he was out there, and uh, you know he was throwing a lot of fastballs. I was looking fastball. Uh, Fouled off two of them, I believe, and then uh, you know he just kind of left, hung a curveball right over the middle of the plate and was able to put a good swing on it. Uh, at the time, John was pretty sharp. I mean, he was sharp the whole game. So uh, you know we had confidence. I thought we were going to score a little bit more runs, and <laughs> I wish we could have. But uh, you know he, he basically carried us the whole night, and that was awesome for him. All right, thank you, players. You're dismissed. <laughs>
you know, again, that, that's what makes our team so good. Is it concerning? I'd like to score 28 runs every game. <laughs> but uh, we're facing good teams. And, and I, actually, I think this is good for us because it's the type of atmospheres that we're going to be in against the type of pitching and the type of teams that we're going to have to face to win regionals, super regionals, and get to Omaha. So to have blowouts right now, it's unrealistic of, of where we're going to be in a week.